Hi, I'm Sean Gannett, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about solving multi step equations. I'm going to solve each equation. So, if I was given this equation 10 times x plus 3 minus negative 9x minus 4 equals x minus 5 plus 3. Well, what I want to do here is I want to combine my like terms on the left and the right hand side. And to do so, I have to distribute, right? So I'm going to distribute actually here. I distribute the 10 across. So we have 10 times x, which is 10x, and 10 times 3, which is 30. From there, I also have to distribute this minus sign. The minus sign gets distributed. Negative times a negative is a positive, so we have a positive 9x here. And negative times a negative again is a positive, so we have a positive 4. On the right hand side, we can combine our like terms. Negative 5 plus 3 is just a negative 2, so we have x minus 2 there. So I'm going to do the same thing now to the left hand side, combine my like terms. My 10x and 9x can combine together to be a 19x, and my 30 plus a 4 is a 34. We bring down the x minus 2 on the right. Now, let's bring our variables to the left and my numbers to the right. So let's subtract an x here to both sides. Okay, subtract x both sides, left with 18x right there. And that's equal to, well, we subtract a 34 to both sides. And we're left with negative 2 minus 34, which is a negative 36. Okay? So now we have 18x equals a negative 36. I want to get x by itself. So I divide by 18 to both sides, right there, leaving the x here by itself is equal to a negative 36 divided by 18, which is a negative 2. And there we have it. Our final answer, x equals negative 2. So let's recap. We're given 10 times parentheses x plus 3 uh, minus parentheses negative 9x minus 4 equals x minus 5 plus 3. So what I want to do now is I'm going to distribute the 10 to both sides, or both parts out of the parentheses. So I got 10x plus 30 right there. And then I distributed the minus side across, 9x plus 4. I simplified then the minus 3 and 5 together to be a negative 2. I then simplify 10x plus 9x to be 19x, and 30 plus 4 to be 34. At this point, I had a variable and a number on one side and a, number, a variable and a number on the other side. And I couldn't simplify it on each side of equal signs. So I had to bring uh, all the variables to one side, all the numbers to the other. So I subtract an x of both sides and subtract a 34 of both sides. That left me with 18x equals a negative 36. From there, divided by 18 of both sides, give me x isolated by itself, and it's equal to our final answer here, which is a negative 2. 